Hey, I'm Cameron McKenzie at Cameron MCNZ on Twitter, and I wanted to very quickly show you how to get a Bitnami Jenkins stack running on AWS. To run the Bitnami Jenkins image with AWS, all you have to do is find the Jenkins Bitnami stack, click on single tier, and scroll down and find the launch Jenkins button. This will launch Jenkins on AWS. Bitnami will ask you where you want your server and what you want your server to be named. For me, I'm just going to accept all of the defaults here, $17 a month to have a little test server that I can use seems more than reasonable to me. So I will click create and the Bitnami image will be created on AWS. Now this does assume that you already have a AWS account. Um, I do, and so I'm just going to allow this to log into my AWS account uh, and create that instance. Notice that it creates a, a user and provides a password for you. You want to kind of write that password down just so that you can log into your instance. Uh, and it'll just take a, a moment, and once this is done, a URL will be provided to me, and I will be able to log into a fully configured and running Bitnami Jenkins image with AWS. And okay, with the Bitnami Jenkins instance telling us that it is 100% completely installed, we can click on the go to application. You notice it's running on port 80, not port 8080, which is slightly different. The username is user, the password is what's configured right there. So you want to copy that in, paste that into the password field, and then sign in and you are now inside of Jenkins. Uh, and if you want, you can always create a new item here and create a new test project. I'll call this the Jenkins Bitnami AWS test, create a little freestyle project, click OK. And we don't really want to do too much over here other than maybe just print out hello world to prove that everything works. So we click on execute shell. And then over here, we just do the command echo hello world. Click apply, click save, run the build job. This should run pretty much instantaneously. We can then look at the build job, take a look at its console output, and we can see hello world right there proving to us that our Jenkins Bitnami image installation on AWS is a complete success. And there you go, that's how easy it is to get a Bitnami Jenkins stack running with AWS. Now, if you've enjoyed that tutorial, why don't you head over to theserverside.com. I'm the editor-in-chief over there. We've got lots of great tutorials on Jenkins, Bitnami, AWS, and anything that has to do with modern enterprise software development. If you're interested in my personal antics, you can follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ and subscribe on the YouTube